Hi everyone, it's Luis Fernandez with the LRF Group with Berkshire Hathaway with EWM. Uh, the day after the election, I thought it would be interesting to see how the stock market reacted to President-elect Trump victory. I'll read you a part here of the uh, CN CNBC uh, uh, report uh, in terms of how the stock market uh, on November 6th behaved. It says here, Dow pops 1,500 points, heads for best day since 2022 after Trump clinches White House. Stock rally sharply on Wednesday with major benchmark hitting records high as Donald Trump won the 2024 presidential election. The Dow Jones Industrial Average surged 1,500 points to a record high or around 3.6%. The last time the blue chip Dow jumped more than 1,000 points in a single day was in November 2022. The S&P 500 also hit an all-time high popping 2.6%, the NASDAQ composite climbed 3% to a record of its own. Uh, it says here, the small cap benchmark Russell 2000 surged more than 6%. Small companies, which are more domestic oriented and cyclical, are believed to enjoy an outside, an outsized benefit from Trump tax cut and protection policy. Uh, Mark Pinto, head of America's Equity at Janus, says Trump is viewed as, as supporting lower corporate tax rates, deregulation, and industrial policies that favor domestic growth of all which could provide more stimulus to the U.S. economy and benefit risk assets. During the 2016 election, the S&P 500 index gained nearly 5% from the day before the presidential election through the end of the year, what became known as the Trump rally. He says that we expect similar trend uh, uh, could play out this time around too. Bitcoin, by the way, uh, hit an all-time high of seventy-five thousand dollars. The uh, dollar index climbed to the highest level since July on the belief that the Trump proposed tariff against major U.S. trade partners would boost the greenback. The ten-year Treasury yield jumped to around four point four five percent. The speculation on Trump's proposed tax cuts and other spending plans would spark economic growth but also widen the fiscal deficit and reignite the uh, the inflation situation. So uh, there you have it. It looks like the stock market is, is taking the uh, the victory of Trump um, his second term in a positive light. We'll see how all this plays out and, and how it actually affects the real estate market as well. I hope this information was informative. Keep uh, listening out to us because we're watching out for you in the best interest of your property. Again, if you uh, planning to move down here to South Florida or anywhere across the country for that matter, we're also licensed, by the way, in New York as well. We are a re relocation specialist team. We can assist you on that on the purchase or buying of, of your property and make it as smooth as possible, the, 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 the transaction. So thank you so much for listening. Until the very next time, uh, all the very best. Bye-bye.